Yo, walk and run season is here. You ready for some walks? Let's we got one this. this Saturday. Yeah. But there's also another one that we're proud to be a part of here at KMTV3. March for Babies brings together more than 5,000 people. They're all going to find something new this year, Mike. Yeah, from the organization Rosemary Opbrook. Good mm -hmm. to see you, Rosemary. Thanks Hi, for coming thank in. You. Mike Brown is with Children's Hospital and Medical Center. Thanks for coming in, Mike. It's Good nice to, to see, see you. you both. Uh, this event has been a part of the community for a long time. Mm -hmm. How long? Since 1970. Mm. We were the first walk to start a charity walk in Omaha. Wow. Mm -hmm. So a founder in that way. This mm -hmm. thing has grown like crazy. You it have has. A huge base. We said 5,000 people. Mm -hmm. And I mentioned they'll find something new. What is it this year? We have the Omaha Street Percussion Band mm -hmm. coming. They're an awesome group of gentlemen who just yeah. bang the heck We've out of you. We've had them here. We've had them. Awesome. Awesome. Aren't quality. they fun? They're, They're great. Very talented. They yeah. are so fun. I'm also thinking about a 5K. Yes, is that new? A run. That's yeah. right. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> I'm like Rosemary. It's not <laughs> just a walk anymore. <laughs> it's a walk. It's a 5K. Yeah. But why is this so popular? This event. I mean, well, 45 years. So you've had a long time to to build a following. Yeah. But what makes it so popular? Well, our mission and Mike's mission. Mm -hmm. We're all about healthy babies. And people who have had, I had twins prematurely 40 years ago, people grow with the March of Dimes. They have their premature babies, they're healthy babies. They stay with us for years and years mm -hmm. as um, sponsors and as supporters. Um, there will be people out there with brand new babies right out of Mike's NICU. Mm -hmm. There will be people with uh, teenagers that worked with us years ago. Mm -hmm. Mike, why did Children's Hospital Medical Center want to get more involved? I mean, I know this isn't a first for you, but I, I know you're more committed than ever this year. Why? Yeah. Well, as Rosemary said, certainly our missions are real complimentary about healthy babies, mm -hmm. healthy children in the community, so it's a natural connection. You know, our, our connection, our relationship with uh, March of Dimes goes way back, uh, clear, all, clear the way back to the 50s. Mm -hmm. uh, both organizations were awfully involved in the polio epidemics mm -hmm. in the 50s. Mm, wow. So And so over time, because we're both concerned with the care of children, it's just grown and evolved. So this is a natural kind of connection between right. our two organizations. It's a national partnership. How do you work together, though? Um, how do you uh, combine your mission with what ch they do at Children's? How does, it, how does the partnership look? Well, we work with their nurses and their social uh, people, and we provide materials for the pa families in the NICU. Mm -hmm. um, we provide educational projects for nurses, NICU nurses. We have a summit every year for medical professionals focusing on premature birth. So it's it's basically a relationship with the the people on the on the floor right. helping then, care for the babies. And then our staff certainly is very involved in the event. Oh, uh, yeah. by virtue yeah. of participation and fundraising and those sorts of things. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, the money raised, any idea based on past years how much you think you'll bring in in 2015? $400,000 at Holy this smokes, one. Holy smokes, wow. Rosemary. Yeah. So where do you direct those dollars? We fund two different, pro well, our, our funds are focused on two different things. Um, education, mm -hmm. half of premature birth is preventable. So if we can educate moms about having a healthy birth outcome, that's very helpful, just like Andrew was talking yes, about. Yes, with One World. Uh, the other half of premature birth, it, mom gets all the right care, the doctors are there with her the whole time, and the baby still comes early. So we fund research to try to figure out why babies come early when they really shouldn't. Mm -hmm. So education and research is it, where and, the money goes. Any one, <coughs> one tip you want to share right there? I know we have some uh, pregnant mothers out there mm -hmm. who might be watching. Anything in particular that you think is a good tip? Go to see your doctor. Get mm -hmm. into Mike's hospital. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, you get them, and they don't deliver there, but yeah, yeah. get the prenatal yeah. care that your care. doctor recommends. The, the mm -hmm. care early yeah. on. Prenatal mm -hmm. care. This is an event where individuals, of course, you can go, but this is a team sport. Yeah. <laughs> this walk. So, what do you recommend for uh, our viewers who want to organize a team and get involved? What's the best way to do it? There will be a, right there a mm -hmm. website on, online. You can go and very easily sign up as a team or an individual or a yeah. family. Mike has 200 walkers coming from Children's oh, Mike, Hospital. That's great. <laughs> and um, it's just a huge, wonderful lot of food, dog friendly, kid friendly. Um, we have bounce houses. Um, it's a, a lot of great stuff for the whole family. It's fun to see everybody in their t shirts. Uh -huh. right? everybody, so you could kind of identify the teammates that way. And sometimes they come up with clever names. Oh, and yeah. for the, the 5K, will that be timed if to serious runners yes. want to add this to their schedule? Yes, their it will schedule? be timed and there will be awards. Mike, the okay. children get their t shirts all designed for this year. Are we okay. ready to go on that? They there? are ready to go, and okay. we hope all 200 people have a t shirt on. Yeah. Uh, right. that's, so we that's should that's be in, yeah, well represented that right. day. It shouldn't be too hard to find your group. No. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we hope you have great weather. Um, I know. Jennifer Griswold um, and Ricky Woods from Starwood of 4.5 both involved um, mm -hmm. as we're preparing to promote the event. We've been a part of it here at KMTV for some time. 
Um, and just like Children's Hospital Medical Center at KMTV, we believe in the March of Dimes. And if you'd like to follow up, go to marchforbabies.org. Thank you both. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. We'll see you. Thank you.